With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, the question is sperm of fern enters an archegonium due to and the options are chemotaxy, phototaxy, thermotaxy or cyclosis. So when we talk about fern, it is a pteridophyte, right? Fern comes under the group pteridophyte in case of plants. Now archegonium here represents the female organ of the plant. It is the female organ of the plant and this female organ is going to have the female gamete which is the egg cell, right? Now the question is asking that how the sperm which represents the male gamete it is going to enter the female organ and reach the egg cell which is the female gamete. So this is completed by the chemical discharge. Chemicals which are secreted or discharged by the neck of the archegonium. Right? Neck of archegonium means the structure, the shape of archegonium is like a flask. Right? Where the base is swollen and large and is called the venter. And then there is a long uh, cylinder neck. So this neck, it secretes some chemicals which attract the sperm to enter the archegonium and reach the egg cell. So this is the phenomena and because it involves chemicals so it would be termed as chemotaxy right it would be termed as chemotaxy so option a here is going to be the right answer if we see other options phyto phototaxy would be wrong because photo is related to light but there is no involvement of light here so this would be wrong thermotaxy would also be wrong thermo in general re is related to temperature this is also wrong and cyclosis is the, in biological terms, cyclosis represents the general cytoplasmic movement in case of a living cell. So this is also wrong. The correct answer here is option A. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.